Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. My apologies about yesterday's Projute. I said Lumber Tycoon 2, and I meant Projute. Uh, yeah, brain fart moment. But not going to have a brain fart moment today because we are going to be talking about Move for Hunger. It is a charitable donation. Uh, charitable. It is a not-for-profit organization that um, moves food and they take donations and they supply food to the hungry. I've got a bunch of information on it and there's gonna be links in the description down below that you can follow and go and check them out and, and do all kinds of awesomeness. But I wanted to talk to them, talk to you first about them because I made a boo-boo. I was going to do a, a, a charity event, a, a live stream charity thing and like do live donations and see the things. And I didn't realize that I myself could go and start the fundraiser. That's my bad. I'm so sorry. My apologies. We're still going to have the uh, the fundraiser. Okay. We're still going to have the charity stream. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be amazing. It's tonight at 7.30 p.m. Central Time. Be there. Uh, also, look around for anybody else doing hashtag uh, stream for hunger. Hashtag stream for hunger. Um, I think that's the hashtag that we're looking for on Twitter. So if you can, tweet that out um, and send it out to anybody that you know. Uh, moms, dads, grandmas, um, aunts, uncles, family. Uh, if you're if you're inside, uh, if you have to work for some reason, if you're if you're an essential, um, put it up on one of the monitors or one of the TVs so you can watch. All right, and, and go find some other somebody else. If you're a content creator, go and create something, whether it's a, a video, a stream, whatever the case may be. There's a form that you can sign up on. I've tweeted it out. Uh, links are going to be in the description down below for content creators to go and do the same thing. You don't, it doesn't have to be today. Okay. If you do this in the future or like a few days from now, next week, whatever the case may be, you can do that too. Okay. Big, big excitement. I'm very excited for this one. And the reason why is because it's here. I'll just go do it. I'll just show it to you. Um, where is my, oh gosh, where is my Google drive? No, hold on. Let me go. Let me go get into my drive real quick. Hold on. There, I found it. All right, hold on. Fade, 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 fade. Right here. Uh, Move for Hunger. Move for Hunger is a national not-for-profit organization that has created a substantial way to reduce food waste and fight hunger. We have mobilized the leaders of the moving, relocation, and multifamily industries to provide their customers, clients, and residents with the opportunity to donate their food when they move. Members of Move for Hunger are also uh, wait Move for Hunger also organize community food drives, participate participate in awareness campaigns and create employee engagement programs. Uh, Move for Hunger Key Facts, uh, founded by Adam Lowry. By the way, La La not Lowry, Lowry? Or was it Lo Lowy? I might have been pronouncing it wrong. Anyhow, huge, huge thing. Let me stop before anything else. Whenever I contacted them or whenever they contacted me, I did not realize Adam was contacting me directly. So it's not like a big board of directors or anything like that. It, he, he himself, the guy that made the place, made, made the entire organization, contacted me through Twitter. That's huge, okay? So that's that in the first eight seconds of the conversation got me all excited. Once I found out who he was and what he was doing, I'm like, yeah, absolutely. We will, we will go and do a stream and it's gonna be big, it's gonna be awesome. So I need you to spread the word. Like, comment, subscribe down below and push this out. Notifications. All that good stuff. Sorry, that that's kind of a plug. I probably shouldn't have plugged right there, but it's fine. Um, by the way, can you tell that I haven't had enough coffee and my ADHD medicine has worn off for the day? You might be able to tell. Maybe. A little bit. <laughs> Move for Hunger began with a simple observation. Adam Lowy. Lowy? Lowy? Adam whose family has owned and operated a moving company in New Jersey for nearly a century, noticed an alarming trend. People throw out a lot of stuff when they move, including tons of perfectly good food. The Move for Hunger Network delivered has delivered over 17 million pounds of food uh, to food banks across the United States and Canada and has helped feed over 14 million people since its inception of 2009. Ince inception? Inception. In 2009. So that's over... What, uh, Let's see, it's 2020 now, so that's over 11 years. 11 years. 
Nice. We partner with more than 1,000 moving companies. So if you're watching right now and your parents are part of a moving company or you yourself are part of a moving company, reach out to these guys. Help them, help them get in contact with you. If you have a moving company that's near you and you happen to know someone, same thing. Reach out and just talk to them. All right. Say, hey, I, I got a organization that does move for hunger do you do you have any like get in, get in contact um since its inception of 2009 we partner with more than 1,000 moving companies 1,500 apartment communities throughout the throughout north america and since 2009 we have helped coordinate nearly 5,000 food drives across north america now that's great for the United States. I wanted to make a real quick point that this video is not just in the United States. This is a global wide thing. And I would love to see moving companies from other countries start setting this kind of thing up in other places. I would love to see that. And I know that you watching right now who isn't from the United States could probably get a hold of someone over in the UK, over in New Guinea, over in India. The Philippines. I know you guys are watching, right? Get a hold of them. Send them a message. Uh, do at Move for Hunger on Twitter and just tell them hi. All right. Just overwhelm them with like, we love what you do. We think it's awesome. Enough about this. Okay. Um, I was going over here. Hold, oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm going to leave a link to their actual donation page. Um, this is on moveforhunger.org, donate COVID-19. So support the Move for Hunger. Um, since the pandemic has started, they've had a lot more people needing food, a lot more food drives because a lot of food just can't move. It can't, it can't get there. So a lot of families are going hungry. Uh, in fact, I, I think one of their facts is like one in eight families has um, doesn't know where they're going to get their next meal and one in six of them are children. That's, that's a staggering, alarming fact because the majority of who watches me right now and, okay, don't be ashamed if you don't know where your next meal is going to come from, okay? Reach out to them. Talk to them. I mean, you're watching me right now on the internet, but if you need food, reach out to Move for Hunger. They'll help you out, I promise. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Sorry, about got emotional right there for a second. Uh, support the Move for Hunger. Help Move for Hunger provide meals for families and children and seniors in vulnerable communities who are struggling as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic. You can do 25, 50, 100, 100 uh, 250. If you can't do that, other amounts are accepted. Uh, you can also do it as a one-time or like a membership on YouTube, all right, where it's a monthly deal. Um, the other thing you can do is, yes, this is a tribute. I don't know. Hold on. Is that going to autofill some stuff in here? Hold on. Let me cut that real quick. Oh, yeah, it does. <laughs> All right. What if I hit escape? There we go. Okay. So um, let's turn that back on. Cut. So it does, uh, it does right here where, yes, this is a tribute. You can say name uh, or occasion. Um, do hashtag stream for hunger. All right. And that way they know that, Hey, that's, this donation came from stream for hunger and, or, or whatever the, the case may be. Um, you can also put in the full name of whoever you want to tribute to them. If you, there's somebody you want to shout out or give a message to, you can do it through here and they'll see that. Okay. Enough of that. There is a second one from Tiltify which I think I signed up for, like I signed up for a Tiltify a long time ago. Anyhow, Move for Hunger, one in eight Americans, oh, there it is. One in eight Americans uh, are food insecure. They don't know where their next meal is coming from. Uh, one in eight Americans relocate each year. Hmm. So donate your food when you move. So um, the links to these two are going to be down in the description down below. I've spent uh, nine minutes and 30 seconds talking about them. And I will, I will send anything that you want your direction. Just look at the links down in the description down below. Uh, and we're going to have a stream tonight with them. Uh, they're probably going to be watching. A lot of people are going to be watching. Uh, hopefully, I can just get you guys to open up your wallets, send out the, the love, and just amazing donations to them. So, um, another fun fact, and this is just real quick. Um, 
a lot of people say, let's do food drives, let's do food drives. That is great. But a lot of problems that happen with food drives is the canned foods have to be sorted, they have to be marked, they have to have movement of some kind. So it takes money and a cost of, of getting all that stuff other places. That's why Move for Hunger is so good is because the moving cost, is, it's on the company. Like that's that's what you guys are paying for. Okay, they're, they're the ones actually getting the food drives to people. Um, when you do a food drive in your community, the best thing that you can do, and this is, you heard it from me, I heard it from uh, Adam Ruins Everything, which is from College Humor. Huge shout out to Adam. Thank you for all the information you gave us. Um, when you do a food drive, it's actually better to donate money. It might sound petty. It might sound, oh, that doesn't sound, that's not like I'm doing something for the community. It is. You are doing something for the community. Giving a donation is actually better than giving canned foods. Because a lot of people will go to the store and try and buy foods, which, don't do that. If you if you have foods in your pantries that you haven't eaten, then, I mean, that's, a lot of people will say, what food do people eat? Or what, what would somebody at a food drive eat? What do you eat? If you wouldn't eat it, then, I mean, why would you donate it? A lot of people do eat it. So, I mean, any donation helps. I don't want to downplay that at all. Let's play some Roblox Lumber Tycoon 2. And I had an idea because inside Roblox, we've got a ton of food items, right? I mean, we've, we've got all kinds of stuff. So I'm going to create a small donation bin right here and I'm going to label it uh, move for hunger. Let's do let's do a large floor just like that. And let's do some walls. Short stub. Oh, I, I don't want a short stub. Uh, what if we did here, let's do let's do um, a smooth wall like this but let's go rotate turn like that. And then we should be able to place it down like that. Place like that, rotate, and place like this, and place like that. Boom. So, uh, let's see. We got a turkey. Oh, wait. <laughs> I gotta fill it in first. I was just, I was ready. Did you see that? I was like, let's get this going. What should I make it out of? Um, should we do goldwood? Goldwood. Let's do goldwood. <gasps> Let's do Glofer. And the reason we want to do some Glofer is in memory of Tic Tac. Or Tic Tac. Tic Tic. Tic Tac. Tic Tac Tort. We'll, we'll throw in a dedication to her as well. If you guys don't know, then uh, I'm, I'm not going to announce it here, but very sad story and uh, I, I do have a video over it um, anytime you go down to the water cave to get the yellow wood it's dedicated to her boop, 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 boop. there we go okay we have our donation box set up um, I am going to grab some wires maybe if I can find find uh, you know what here you know what? I can, I can break this down and use it. Whoop! Sitting on the toilet. And let's just type M. M. Oops. Oh. Oh, actually, if we make it diagonal like this. That looks awkward, doesn't it? Hold on. We'll go we'll go around one time like that. Move. And then I should be able to go here. move <laughs> that was kind of cool all right I don't know how I'm going to do the F on food and I'm, I'm just going to do the number oh you know what I can do uh, I can do a cursive for right this is cursive fours right 
move for oh, that's a little far over let's come over just a tad bit move four like that and then we'll do one more boop, 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 boop. By the way, if you don't have money to donate uh, to them directly, then absolutely go into Lumber, all right? Collect up your canned foods or, or food items and like screenshot this and tag them in that to show your support, show your awareness and get it to tweet out or get it to retweet or whatever social media you're on. If you wanna do a Snapchat, do a Snapchat. If you wanna do Instagram, do Instagram. There's no limit to what this is as long as it's somewhere in the content creation of social media anywhere. Facebook. Do Facebook. Let Grandma see it. <laughs> Sorry, that probably insulted a lot of people. I do apologize. I just don't use Facebook. That's all. I started on MySpace a long time ago. And then we kind of got kicked out of Facebook because... <sighs> Never mind. I'm going to stop while I'm ahead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, let's see, uh, uh, how am I going to do the F? If I, if I do like this, maybe, and then come down like that, maybe. I don't know if this is going to work or not. Oh, oh, here we go. I can just do this. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Ideas are happening. Hold on, hold on. Um, let's do this. Hold on. You're gonna be like, Code, what are you doing here? I don't know if I'm going to have enough wire. I don't know if I'm going to have enough wire. No. Please don't mess up. Oh, did we do it? Did we do it? I think we got it. Boom. Move for food. There we go. Uh, and by the way, if you're searching it up, you actually have to spell out for F-O-R, not F-O-U-R, and not the number four. It's F-O-R. Um, let's see. Chicken axe is not edible. Um, gingerbread axes, we could absolutely do that, even though you don't eat gingerbread houses. We're, we're gonna gr throw some of those in there. Uh, what is this, this is a sled. Can't eat a scoob head. Uh, ducky. Let's see, can't eat eyeballs, can't eat a cone. There is a turkey right there. That's an original turkey. Boom, throw that in there. Let's see, don't we have, yep, we got, a, got another turkey right here. So that's three turkeys. Man, we are going to make somebody happy. So, uh, if anybody from food, uh, move for move for hunger, move for food. Did I do, did I really just do that? Hold up. <laughs> it's <coughs> move for food. No, it's move for hunger. Oh my gosh, I did that completely wrong, didn't I? All right, move it. All right. Um. Hunger is a bit of a bigger word. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. You got this, Heath. You got this. Oh, that's not going to look right. If I come down like this. No, I can't do a U. That's weird. B. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go right. Here and kind of go up first. Oh, come on, come on. That is way too big. Can we can we do like this? No, it doesn't look right. It looks weird. Hunger. 
Hunger. Hunger? H-U-N-G-E-R. H-U-N-G... E... Oh, oh, too short. Too short. E... Uh, how am I going to do an R? You know what? We can come down here. Go up here like this. Did I just go off the side? <laughs> it looks great from the front, hunger, but you turn here to the side and it's like, what? What do you? What do you do there, code? What is? What is that? That's fine. That's fine right there. That'll be a great screenshot, by the way. Hunger. Oh, oh, that's awesome. Move for hunger. There we go. Got the donation. Oh, wait, wait. wait. We need to do a screenshot, don't we? Hold on. Screenshot. Move for hunger. Right there. Picture taken. Done. Okay. So, what else can we donate? Um, let's see here. I've got all kinds of food items over here. There's there's another turkey. We're going to give the food items first, and then we'll give the sweets. Okay? Uh, you guys know what I'm talking about. We are talking about this right here. That hot cup of chocolate that everybody knows and loves. Boom. Hot cup of chocolate. Yay. Chocolate, chalky milk, as my daughter calls it. Chucky milk. Let's see, Alpha Axe can't eat those. Not many axes. Do, do they need plates? Do you think they need plates? You know what? We'll throw a plate in there as a symbolism. There we go. Ooh. And by the way, if the Move for Hunger guys are watching, um, if you want to come pick up these donations and take them, you absolutely can. Just contact me on Twitter at Code Primate. Here we go. Here's uh, here's another chocolate milk. Uh, that one might be bad. It's it's not coming out. You know what? It's a gelato. It's fine. It's it's fine. It'll be good. <laughs> oh, that's horrible code. You shouldn't have said that. I know. Probably not. But it's it's okay. Um, I know. Growing up, I my my parents didn't have a lot of money, and we. We pretty much lived paycheck to paycheck. Um, my mom was very good with credit cards. Um, she didn't manage them all that well, but she was very she had very good credit uh, as far as our, her score goes. So, whenever I needed cash or school clothes or whatever, whatever the case may be, I was never without. But it was a struggle on our family. Like we we made sure first and foremost that we had food. Um, if a bill had to be skipped or if it had to be waited upon until like the next month or the beginning of next month, they would default and they would have a little bit of an overcharge, you know, and that's a normal part of life. A lot of people struggle with that. Whoa, big lag spike right there. Um, I'm not going to justify like not paying your bills, but at the same time, if it comes down to feeding my family versus paying my internet bill, you better believe I'm going to be feeding my family first. And I, I think that should be how it is. But I also think that nobody should... Uh, <laughs> nobody should be hungry. You shouldn't have to worry about where your next food comes from. I had a lot of friends growing up in, in middle school and high school that I didn't I didn't realize that they didn't know if they were going to have dinner that night. They didn't know if food was going to be on the table. Their only meals were at school. It was school lunches. And they were provided meal tickets for lunch. Now there is plenty of help out there. Move for Hunger is n not the only charitable donation, chari uh, like non-profit organization doing this. There's a lot of them out there. And they're all understaffed. There's, there's so much that you can be done. Volunteering your time, right? And if you don't know what you're going to do with your life growing up, 
go and spend some time helping out, volunteering at a place. If you're in college right now, if you're planning on going to college, plan to get a job working for a, a hand-me-down place, a, a, a place that does, not a pawn shop, don't do pawn shops, but like um, Goodwill. Go work at Goodwill and just learn and see because that's the that's the best thing you can do the becoming aware of your your community and aware of your surroundings of like what's going on that's that's huge um a lot of the inner city stuff i like homeless um soup kitchens stuff like that a lot of it we we think of this oh well they're they're homeless because of this and that's not true a lot of situations happen where the person they are mentally stable they've got a great job and they just got laid off um a lot of the times there's a situation where somebody becomes homeless because they were worried about food for their family and they faulted on like their mortgage payment to the bank and the bank takes the the house i've been in a situation like that where we were worried about our house getting taken away that was a long time ago and it was it was a long time ago but I've been in that situation. I know the scariness. I know getting the phone calls. And it's not fun. So, one thing you should not have to worry about is whether or not you're going to have dinner. Or whether or not you're, you've got food. We shouldn't have to worry about that. <sighs> a lot of countries, a lot of countries have poverty lines that just are unfathomable, fathomable, fathomable, fathomable. I'm not sure if I'm saying it right, but, oh, we got a blue bone turkey. Look at that. That is a succulent meal right there. A delicacy among most Robluxians, the blue bone turkey. It tastes like blueberries. <clears throat> You're right, it does. All right, there we go. Uh, we're not gonna feed them dynamite. We, oh, we could say they're cinnamon sticks, no. Just saying. Burr, 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 burr. We are at 27 minutes and 35 seconds. I know I spent a lot of time talking at the beginning. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> we could not go this entire stream without mentioning the candy cane axe. And, uh. <laughs> I hope you got that. Because if you didn't. You haven't watched enough of my videos. <laughs> and I will never tell. <laughs> okay, let's go. <gasps> How did I forget all the candy bars? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Hold on. Let's get this let's get this uh, golden toilet out of here. You get up there. Alright, let's look real quick. Uh, are there any other things? These are eyeballs and heads. Uh, nope. You can't eat amber, right? So, we'll get that. Oh, here we go. Okay. There's a turkey. We want that. And then we're going to give at least two of every kind. So here's the Sinisters, a.k.a. Snickers. Here are the Lumbars. Here are some Chomps. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't glitch it out. Don't glitch it out. And here are three three developers. <laughs> the three musketeers. Uh, oh, gosh. Wait. Walnut roll. We don't want to take from the front. The fronts are kind of like labels. And oh, that's a sinister. What are you what are you doing over here? You're supposed to be down there. And the last one is a Hoover's bar. Hoover's. <laughs> mm. Hoover, you have been a little rascal lately, haven't you? Uh, and we are going to donate one of the bags to him. Uh, in fact, I'm just going to real quick open this bag, let it pop out. Perfect. And to be extra specially special. Hold on. Do, do, 
Dun, 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 dun. Hold on, do I have one? Let's see. I'm not sure if I have one. Man, everything was left open, wasn't it? Oh, no, I don't want to destroy anything. By the way, if you did not know, uh, this is actually a full replica of my kitchen, my actual kitchen in my house. And I, I actually did side by side. <laughs> There's the cheated for this box axe, in, AKA the end times axe. Uh, I had a tweet with my real kitchen and this kitchen side by side. It's amazing how it looks. You'd be like, really? That, that looks just like it. Got your washing machine over here. I got the oven right there. No, I don't want to destroy it. Can we close it, please? There we go. Now what about these? Oh, purple head. Nothing in there. Normally I cl keep cleaning supplies down here. Okay, where are you at? Look for the bright pink. Oh, that's an alpha axe. Aha! Ha ha ha! There you are, you little rascal. By the way, it's not a full replica because I don't have a roof. <laughs> or a ceiling, I guess. I have a roof. I have a roof over my head, just no ceiling. Alright, um, careful, careful. Hold on, I gotta back this up. Oh, 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 come on. Get back in. Get back in there. Yay! There we go. Back this up. Oh, am I gonna be able to get over there? I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get over there. I might have to move a saw blade or two. That's okay. It was in the way anyway. It needed to be moved. There we go. Back it up. Back it up. This donation's move for hunger. Move. We're going to move that out of the way as well. There we go. A door randomly on the side of the house. Never been done before. <laughs> and let's give it a good whack. There we go. If we, if you back your car into something, the momentum will usually carry stuff to the back, so. Lots of candy bars, lots of snacks and foods and good stuff here. All for Move for Hunger. Links are in the description down below. Spread the word, spread the awareness. I need you to be at someone's stream or someone's video tonight. Uh, I know that I'm announcing it now, but I mean, that goes for anyone. If you're a content creator and you're sending it out today, today is the day. Friday, uh, the first. And anytime after. Don't be afraid if, if you want to do something in the future. I am currently in the process of getting them set up. Okay, so real quick. Um, I know I said I wouldn't talk about it. I'm going to talk about it because that's what this entire video is about. Boop, cut. Okay, let's go back over to the this thing. Channel monetization. Let's talk about a little thing called channel monetization. There is a tab whenever you're inside studio, over here on monetize, go to giving, add a fundraiser. All right, create a fundraiser. And then you can come in here and say, which non-for-profit organization are you wanting to show off? And that's when you say, um, move for hunger. They don't show up. <gasps> Code, is it a real thing? Yes, it is. Because right here, not-for-profit data from GuideStar. Let's go ahead and click on them. Hello, GuideStar. Do you have anybody for move for hunger? Make sure you spell out F-O-R. Right here it is. Move for Hunger's food drive campaigns are educational, inspirational, and community up-to-date. Blah, 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 blah. New Jersey, right there. That's them. Move for hunger. Boom, donate now. It's them. It's it's their thing. Do it. <laughs> so what I've done is I did a request, a non, not for profit request to be added to the list. I put their name in there. Uh, in fact, I think move for hunger. If you try and add a new one, it'll pop down like that. Click. Uh, this is not for profit is already under under review. They weren't like that before. 
I did that. I put it in there. So in the future, if we do another one of these like next year or something like that, this is going to be in there. You should be able to do this. Keep an eye out. If you want to do your charity stream a little bit later, like next week or sometime after, go look for this. Do your charity stream with hashtag move for hunger in here. Okay. This is, this is how you do it with uh, streams on YouTube. Um, Twitch might be a little bit different. I don't know how you monetize over there. So uh, same thing with, um, what's the other one? Mixer, Mixer, sorry, Just brain fart. Anyhow, that's gonna do it for me. I am out of here. Fade, 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 fade. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go play some games. I'm gonna go hang out for a little bit and get this video uploaded. Uh, no edits, like always. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope uh, I brought some awareness to you and I hope that you're there for somebody's stream. It doesn't have to be mine, but I'm going to be at 7.30 tonight p.m. Central Time. Somebody, find somebody, go watch them, go support them, go donate, all right? Love you guys very much. Have a great night. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out like a good YouTuber does at the end of these videos. But it's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, I'm cool with that too. You were here, you watched, you put up with me for an hour. <laughs> or at least 30 minutes. So, love you guys very much. Have a great night. And we'll talk to you very soon. <sighs> I, I love the dance. I love the dance that he does at the end. And I love the song. By the way, it's by the Fat Rat. Outro.